you are going to hate me doing this. I'm recording this video while I'm driving, uh, but you don't worry. I'm going to focus on my driving. You focus on the SQL video for today. So I had put up a video on SQLshigra.com on uh, talking about the joints, the difference between logical join operators and physical join operators. And um, I got a lot of questions and feedback. And one of the questions uh, where people were asking me uh, which physical join operator is better or good. Uh, there are three of them, nested loop join, merge join, and hash join. So the this is a myth that one join type is better than the other. There's, there's nothing like merge is better than nested loop or hash is better than merge. Uh, the optimizer will choose the right type of join uh, based on the cost factor, depending on the size of the inputs and which, I mean, for example, relatively, if you see out of the two inputs, if one input is considerably much larger than the other one, you might see the optimizer chooses the uh, hash join. Uh, likewise, uh, uh, another factor is the join operator that you are using. For example, if two inputs are sorted and you're using an equality join operator, then the optimizer may go for merge. So it is completely a decision of the optimizer to choose the right uh, type of join. Uh, you should not worry too much about that. Now, this being said, uh, so the conclusion is that, uh, and the answer is that no join type is better uh, than the other one. Uh, and um, also, uh, this being said, uh, the optimizer in most cases will do a fantastic job. It will produce a good efficient execution plan, but it might also happen that sometimes the optimizer is, uh, um, you know, it doesn't produce a good plan and that happens rarely. And that is why uh, SQL Server gives you the option to apply join hints. You can always hint the optimizer that you uh, want a different type of join uh, over what the optimizer has chosen. So what you can do is uh, at the end of the uh, query, you can say option, which is applying a hint. You can say option and you can specify which type of join do you prefer. So you could say, let's say merge join or you could say hash join. Now, of course, the criteria have to be met. For example, if you force the optimizer using the hint, if you force the optimizer to apply a merge join, but the inputs are not sorted and you are using any other operator other than the quality operator, you might get an error. So you got to take care of such things. Now, even though I say you can do that, this is something that we rarely do. We Applying a query hint or a join hint uh, is definitely the last resort. In most cases, it's not required. You may want to fix statistics. You may want to fix indexes. You may want to fix a lot of other things before you actually uh, apply a, a hint to improve the uh, query performance. So um, that's it uh, for this video. The subject is pretty big. It's huge talking about joins and the optimizer and the best practices. But uh, in this quick video, I just wanted to demystify the fact that no one join operator is better than the other. So that no notion uh, should not be uh, there. By the way, SQL Shigra. Shigra is uh, a Sanskrit word. It means uh, quick and uh, that's where uh, the whole idea of sqlshigra.com is to learn on the fly, learn while you're driving. Uh, and uh, that's where this uh, word SQL Shigra uh, comes from. So with this, um, I will hang up now. I'm just looking at where is the exit. Yeah. So with this, I will hang up and um, uh, yeah, thanks for watching and hope this was uh, something uh, useful. Uh, do share the video with your friends and uh, colleagues and you can watch more videos on sqlshigra.com. S-Q-L-S-H-I-G-H-R-A.com. Thanks for watching. Talk to you soon.